Road closures still stretch all 469 miles of the Blue Ridge Parkway. And with the change in fall foliage fast approaching, some businesses are concerned about what this means for their bottom line. WDBJ 7's Amir Massenberg tells us how the closure is impacting a nearby inn and the work the National Park Service is still trying to tackle tonight. My phone's been ringing off the hook. It's truly been a very frustrating situation. It was supposed to be the start of a busy fall season for Tuggles Gap Roadside Inn in Floyd County, now turning into canceled reservations and lots of questions from customers. It couldn't be worse timing for the storm to have hit right as a leaf changing season is coming in. Hurricane Helene knocking down trees and creating mudslides and holes on the parkway, causing an indefinite closure. Co-owner and innkeeper Nicholas Beenick saying it's causing a huge financial strain on the inn. You know, we're having to um, look to our insurance for some loss of uh, income coverage because it's a substantial amount that we've lost. <laughs> Over 200 National Park Service employees are helping with the recovery of the parkway. It is a, a relatively small and tight-knit agency, and when one of our parks is in trouble, uh, people drop what they're doing and come down to assist. Mike Litterist with the National Park Service's Eastern Incident Management Team, saying they're hoping to open parts of the parkway in Virginia next week, with most of the damage being in North Carolina. We're tracking... Um, three dozen mudslides and rock slides that, that, that need to be cleared. Um, at least nine of those slides have caused damage to the roadway. In some cases, the roadway is entirely washed away. While the parkway is closed, there are still other ways for people to enjoy the area. We're also just reminding people that Places like Explore Park and the Peaks of Otter that are really popular Blue Ridge Parkway pull-offs and attractions, they are still open and they are still accessible. Floyd and other communities on the parkway are open for business and we could use your help. In Floyd County, Amir Massenberg, WDBJ7.